welcome back to Maniacal Reader. It's Tuesday. That means it's time for another Tuesday Talks. Tuesday Talks is a Goodreads group that was created by Janie and Janelle over at Goodreads. I'll put a link in the description down below in case you guys want to check out the group and join us. The topic is, have you ever DNF'd a book and put it down, but then picked it up again and finished it? For me, this question did come as a surprise to me because I never used to be a person who could answer this question, but this instance has happened to me twice in the last little while. This did happen to me with Confess by Colleen Hoover, which is a new adult romance book. The romance between the two characters in this book was too insta-love. There were also like problematic side characters in this book, which I didn't like at all. And I didn't like the plot twist with one of the side characters from this book. And because of all of this, it was just hard for me to get through the book. I felt like I was slugging through it. So I put it down and actually chose to DNF it. But I wanted to know what happened. And at the end of this book, I did end up picking it up again and finishing it after about a week or so. I ended up giving Confess 2 out of 5 stars. In the end, the main love interest for this girl later on in the book was just too possessive and commanding. That turned me off of the book completely. It ended up being a disappointing read. The second time this happened is when I read November 9 by Colleen Hoover. The instant love between Fallon and Ben, the two main characters in this book, was too instant love and again I found myself slugging through this book and it didn't really seem like there was a believable connection in between these two characters at all. But as I continued to read the book, I realized why Ben was so drawn to Fallon in the first place. I warmed up to their relationship and I ended up giving this book. 3 out of 5 stars. I used to be a person who could never answer a question like this since I never ever DNF books, but it just so happened that I did put a couple of books down in the last little while. One ended up being really bad, the other her one ended up being an okay book, one that I would read again. Those are my thoughts on this topic. Comment down below and tell me, have you ever DNF'd a book? and picked it up again and finished it? Were your expectations fulfilled or were you extremely disappointed? Let me know down below. That's it for my video today. I hope you guys enjoyed it. I'll see you guys in my next video. Bye!